my neighbor decided to mow his lawn right the moment that I wanted to film. Natalie is playing and she has found a new noise that is like a scream-ish deep voice so if you can hear her in the background that's why but she is downstairs and that sound is very very loud so I'm sorry but that's just my life right now. Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do an update for the deck of panning collab. I know I did not do it last month. I didn't think that I had uh, an, enough progress to show you guys and then I remembered that I finished an item and then I looked at my list of things and I saw that I hit goal on another one so it's actually a very exciting update. <laughs> I don't think I would have met these two goals last month anyway so maybe it was a good thing that I waited two months <laughs> to update you guys but here we are I have some progress to show you guys I'm pretty excited about it to be quite honest this project is created by Emily if you don't know her you definitely should know her she is amazing she's beautiful and she is so creative like so creative and a fellow mom <laughs> I love her so much. She got inspired by a booktuber for this project and it is basically where you have a deck of cards. She has created a game board that she sh shuffles with some prompts and each card of this deck corresponds to a slot on the game board. In the end of this video we are going to draw two new cards for the two items that I am ruling out of project. I am working on five items and oh we all are. So let's just go through them and let's take the most boring one first. And the first one is the Joker item that I got in my intro. That was a loud noise. The Joker is like are you joking? Like I don't want to pan that, should I really pan it? And I chose this highlighter. And since the intro in January, I have worn it four times. So the struggle of hitting 20 is so real, <laughs> like so real. This is a W7 Glow Fix Holographic Highlighting Stick. This is a blue highlighter. The shift is blue, the base is a clear one. It's a beautiful highlighter, but I don't think of this blue cream highlighter when I am doing my makeup. Even though it stands right before, right in front of my nose when I do my makeup, I don't gravitate towards it. Four uses for this one and no progress at all. I really want to roll it out by next month, but I don't think I can do that. Let's just take this one because this is very boring as well. I have used it a handful of times since last update, like two months ago. <laughs> It has been living in my purse, even though I have my purse everywhere I go and most of the time I actually am wearing makeup, I just don't uh, reapply lipstick for some reason. So now it's out of my bag, I'm going to place it on my vanity uh, where I do my makeup so I can put this on before we go out the house so I can actually meet my goal of either fi finishing this or 20 euros. I do believe my notes here says finish, but I don't know if I can do that. Maybe if I actually focus on it, maybe I can. Tell me wear makeup, but I just don't wear a lot of makeup. I don't. The slightly better one, but it's not that boring. It is my Franken bronzer that I wanted to hit pan on. I just needed to check I don't have pan on it. <laughs> Either, uh, no, it's just shimmer I think. I made a Franken bronzer in, uh, in an empty slot in this Gwen Stefani MDK palette and I wanted I want to hit pan on it. I have no idea if you can see the dip because it has a very huge dent right up here. I have no idea if you can even see the shadow but I don't think I'm that far away from hitting pan again because I don't know how much side pan you can see there 
and then comparing it to the size of or the depth of the pan itself so i do think i am pretty close to reheating pan on that one there is a small 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 bit of pan side pan over here but i don't think that counts yet so maybe by next month this can be a goal hit i really hope so that would be so amazing i have been working on that frank and bronzer for like two years now so now i really want it gone then we have the item that i hit goal on which is this dandelion blush from benefit it is like a um, deluxe sample um it's not the full size but it's not a teeny tiny one either my goal was to use this 20 times because i were working on three blushes when I worked this in, now I'm working on this one and another one. I have been focusing on this one because the other one that I, I really want to have pan on in a uh, pan and everything, Patrick Pan on, and I have used it 50, 50, 22 times. <laughs> um, so that is very exciting that I hit 20 users mark, and maybe you can see the progress. There has been this line in the blush when i rolled it in and um, so maybe you can see the dip the item that i finished is this one this is my lip scrub from w7 it is the jelly crush lip scrub and as you can see i have had it in my shower the packaging is very uh, damaged wet as you can see it's not wet now because it has been out of my shower for like a week i knew i had this in a project but for some reason I couldn't figure out which project it was so I had to uh, look back on videos and then I realized it was this one so that was just really nice I have finished it as you may can tell from me talking my goal was definitely to finish it because as you can see from the picture I did not have a lot left um, so that was very exciting to have rolled this in and have finished it we are not even halfway through the year and I have finished two of these. And I have been working on this specific one for like one and a half, maybe two years now. That blows my mind that I only have one more of these left. So that is that is exciting. I'm very, very happy about this. I'm so excited to see the game board. I have not seen it. I've only seen a few updates. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm stoked. I'm so excited. <laughs> <clears throat> I am editing my video and I realized that I had this product in, in and I'm actually going to declutter it because as I said in my last update two months ago, I don't know if you remember, I broke this tube. I guess it's called when I wanted to add in some jojoba oil and stuff like that so it broke off in the packaging since then I have used it a few times like a handful and half of the time I did not like it but now there's oil everywhere and it's not really workable I want to say it's it's not it's not creamy liquid anymore excuse my appearance so i hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video bye so i have my game my game board no i have the cards here eh. i have the cards i'm going to shuffle i'm going to pull two cards and then I'm going to see the game board, what cards they are. And I'm not going to say anything because the last few times I have, I have jinxed it. So I get something that I don't want. So let's hope. Hmm. Let's hope I don't get what I'm thinking about. So.
see this one. The nine of diamond, moody, right? Sometimes I can I can uh, the names in English because they is named something totally different in Danish. Or mad eye, moody or mad eye? I don't know. No, <gasps> no. Are you joking? Oh my god! It is. I'm so sad. I'm so sad. No. <sighs> no. 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 Uh, I don't want to. I if I already have a joker in here. Yeah, the joker. And I only have one in my deck. The other ones are in the box. What are the odds? Oh my... I'm so mad. <laughs> I'm so mad. So, okay. Let's go see what the nine of diamonds is on the game board. I'm so sad. And my computer is no on battery. So that is just perfect. Really want to catch my reaction for the nine of diamonds. Here we are. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, game board. Okay, nine of diamonds. A summer item. Something that reminds me of summer, right? Or can be used in the summer, I think. An obvious one would be a tanning product or a SPF or a bronze or something like that, but I don't want to pan any of those. I don't even know if I have bought an SPF yet, and we are in the <laughs> we are almost in June, but the weather here in Denmark it's just crap. There are no sun, and I have to think about the Joker. And so the summer one is hard. Okay, let let me go. What and uh, look in my collection to see what I have. You like my new hair? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's just miss. I'm sorry, but let's go see. I am here with my two products. One of them is okay. Like the summer item is okay, but the Joker one is like just a bad timing and. Yeah, I don't want to pan it because it's not really a summer, summer item, but I just like the blue highlighter, I think I can make it work. Let's start off with the, the summer item, the nine of diamonds, which were a summer item, like something that reminds you of summer or something you would use in the summer. And I chose this small hand cream from the body shop. It is with the scent. Uh, coconut and coconut definitely reminds me of summer and vacation and the warm countries and stuff like that. So I'm going to finish this. <laughs> it could be a joker item because I'm very bad about panning hand creams if you have followed me for a few years. Um, I tried to pan a hand cream last year and it is still here. I failed <laughs> at that one, but the body shape hand creams are so much nicer than the one that I tried to pan last year and that was why I tried to pan it. So let's see how fast this one can go. This is with 30 milliliters and it's like one fluid ounce. So hopefully this can go rather fast. <laughs> I really want to finish this one. So. Let's see if we can do that. I was not going to pan a bronzer because I am already working on this one and one in the graveyard project pan and one um, in the pan and everything project pan. So it would be stupid to add in another one, even though I had something from the Life's a Beach collection from WSMN, which was an obvious choice. But I do think 
I got away with the coconut very well. The Joker item. Joker item. Something you definitely don't want to pan. Like, are you joking? Are you going to pan that? And... <sighs> I actually had a hard time finding something that I really didn't want to pan and then I got down to what category I didn't want to pan and that was definitely a lip product or a cheek product but a lip product I was just like I, I am working on a lot because I'm very bad at going through lip products and then I was like I can definitely just use a nude I, I want to pan a nude and then I was like I don't want to pan something extremely bright like a blue or green but I definitely don't want to pan something very dark in the summertime so I thought this was a good getaway <laughs> a good middle thing because this is not this dark in the tube but a little bit more bright red and if I topped it with something lighter or put something lighter underneath, <laughs> I, could, I could get away with it. Me trying to make up for having a joker, another joker in the project. This is the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream. Another liquid lipstick <laughs> in Copenhagen. I really like this liquid lipstick. Don't get me wrong, I love the formula but not at dark red in the summer. This was one of the items where I was looking for a dark red. Little did I know I needed to go even darker, like, what's it, what's it called, Trans Transylvania? Is it called that? The very dark red one. This is like a semi-red color. Still dark, don't get me wrong, but not dark as the tube. It's not entirely a yogurt thing. It's a wine red color. It's very beautiful and for my pale skin it's actually really really nice on the lips and I really do love the soft matte lip cream formula from NYX and this is getting older. I bought it in Germany when I lived there and that is five years ago now. Six. Oh my god. In a few months it has been five years since I got home. When did I buy this? In the middle of that year, so 2015, 2016, they are in the middle of those two years. Around Christmas. Oh my god. Uh, six years. Oh my god. I need to <laughs> I need to use this up. That's not good. <laughs> Um, so, yeah, a goal of mine is to use it 10 times. I know I, d I mostly do 20 uses, but yeah, 10 uses is more than enough for this item. I hardly can get 5 uses on the blue highlighter, so I, d I think this is going to be 10 as well. I know some of you may think that is cheating, but I really want to be more effective about this project, and that is that was why I joined for the fun and right now I'm not having that much fun because I don't have that much progress on my items so my two yoga items are going to be 10 uses instead of 20. So that is everything for this project update. I really hope you guys enjoyed enjoyed me seeing and getting another freaking joker. <laughs> I'm so <laughs> like what are the odds? Between all of these cards, I get a joker. I hope you guys enjoyed this update. Check out the other ladies down below in the master sheet, master spreadsheet, and Emily and everyone. They're doing amazing. <laughs> I am very behind of watching videos, but I can already tell people are doing great because we are in a big chat group. I'm excited about my two new items. I'm excited to see how I do. I hope you guys want to stick around if you're new here. Otherwise, I will just see you guys in my next video. Bye!